APC presidential election. Why we did not vote for Sani Yarima, Zamfara delegate. Welcome to the news and thank you for tuning in to listen. Reasons have emerged as to why the former governor of Zamfara State, Ahmed Sani Yari, who was one of the presidential aspirants, was not able to clear the vote of the delegate from the state during the just concluded or progressive congress presidential election. One of the delegates who declined sharing his identity said although Yorima was the doyen of Zamfara politics, but he has lost some of his political relevance due to some factors. Speaking with Daily Post in Gusau, the state capital, the politician explained that almost 90% of Zamfara state indigents have lost political interest in the former governor because of his parochial political strategy. We are all aware of the anti-party activities played by Senator Ahmad Sani Yorima during the reign of former President Gulok Jonathan. Senator Yari claimed that he was not a member of the People's Democratic Party, PDP, but he organized 53 Islamic clerics in 2015 to Saudi Arabia to pray for Jonathan against the all-progressive Congress he claimed to be his party. The funny thing about the whole issue is that Senator Ahmed Sani Yarima is a Muslim while former President Gulag Jonathan is a Christian. Then how can such a combination work perfectly? That and other political problems linked to Senator Yerima destroyed his political dynasty in the state. Even the locals in the state cannot speak good about a senator. Continuing, he stated that when Governor Bello Mohammed Watawali, former Governor Abdul Aziz Yari, and Senator Kabir Garba Marafa were having political problems within the all progressive Congress in the state, which is said led to factionalizing the party. Yerima refused to amend the cracks on the walls of the party. Yerima, who claims to be the doyen of Zamfara politics, could not call the warring factions to order since he actually made all of them politically, but he formed an unholy alliance with Governor Matawali. Even the only four votes he got from Zamfara state delegate, two came from Bakura, his own local government area where the other two came from Anka local government, where his mother came from and where he was born. He said, over 25 delegates followed the new political godfather in the state, who is the former governor, Abdulaziz Yari, saying they will go wherever he goes politically. Though Senator Ahmed Sani Yerima bought former governor Abdulaziz Yari to political limelight, the former governor has relegated Jerima to the background politically because Jerima sold his political relevance. Please, I, it is doing me like I'm not hearing well. So the major thing for not supporting was that he supported Jonathan. Kai, oh wow. These people are very, very ethnic. They are very, very, they are tribalistic. They are tribalism, they even smile. I shall say Americans, we for America, the perceiver. What is wrong with Jerima supporting Jonathan? Now, between Jonathan and Buhari, who is better? I know you, Harry. I know you prefer Buhari leftists. I'm telling you, I don't understand. Hi. DJ did not complain about bandits that affected them. His complaint is very organized prayer for Jonathan. My dear, I tire. Brainwashed people. The only thing Zamfra people benefit from Buhari is banditry killing, rustling of cow, and kidnapping of students in the community. Okay, on this note, we have come to the end of the news. We say thank you for tuning in to listen. Until I come here next time, enjoy the rest of your day.